I'm really enjoying the sort of characterization of certain characters. Like, I feel Kenpachi's one is on point. It's just cool. Tosin and I forget the other captain's name, they sort of get it right because they talk a lot, but they don't really contribute to the storyline until all the way in the Aronkar arc later on when they're fighting. So it's a little, you know, sub-story uh, thing. And the other captains are just like Sofon and Yoruichi, that, 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 that's, that's fucking on point. Because I remember when I got into Bleach and I started researching and all this sort of stuff. You know, when you get into an anime, you A, download the soundtrack, B, binge the shit out of it, and C, you're like, what the fuck is going on between these characters? And I found that there was a few, um, like, specials in Japan. I don't even know if it was an episode. It might have been, like, a little video or something. And in one of them, I think it was a Valentine's Day one where Soifon was making a Valentine's Day card and chocolates or something for uh, Yoruichi. And when she was about to give it to her, she turned into a fucking cat. So she likes her. Uh in more than a, you know, senpai kohai sort of relationship, she actually has legitimate feelings for her. And, you know, going back in her sort of character and the way she was raised, you know, the lack of affection and Yoruichi being the only one that gave her affection and also, you know, other things. Things like that can develop. Uh, feelings like that can develop, but it is a cocktail of emotions. Uh, the best way I could sort of put that into context for anyone that's not familiar to Bleach or anyone that also watches uh, or in plays Metal Gear Solid, you had the same relationship between Solid Snake, you know, Naked Snake and the boss, where when he was asked by uh, Ava or Eva uh, if he loves her, he says he's more complicated than that. It's like we lived and died together, uh, trained together. It, it was, it's more, it's sort of more complicated than, okay, do you like her? It, it's, it's kind of all the things. Uh, in a strange sort of way, so I can understand that, especially from Sofo and, you know, being essentially raised as a ninja, as a servant, and then instead of being, you know, just like a tool, you know, as she was raised to not value herself, you know, which you valued her as a person and sort of helped her develop. So she sort of nurtured that. So in a way, she's a mother figure that's not a mother figure. She's a friend that's sort of not a friend. It, it gets weird. It gets weird because... She didn't actually have any feelings or emotions for anyone else. And nor does she, pretty much. She doesn't show any emotion for anyone in her squad. She doesn't show any emotion to any other character. Um, and then there's Yoroichi, where she literally just balls out and cries her eyes out in front of. And all this sort of thing. So, yeah, yeah it's I, I don't know why I kind of went off on a tangent. But I'm really liking uh, the way the abridged is going. I know it's going in a comedic sort of... Uh, angle and I really do appreciate that but at the same time I appreciate that it doesn't just make fun of the characters but it keeps them in character and that's one of the qualities of a good abridged is when the abridged character stays very true to the canon character themselves so it's sort of like a uh what if you know, as it should be, rather than a, we're making fun of every character. You can make fun of the characters and poke fun of them, but if it stays true to the character, you can sort of feel that that is the character. Uh, and that's, that's what a good abridge is all about. And I consider this a very, very high tier abridged. It's very well thought through. You know, I'm not judging anything, you know, on visuals or anything. The visuals are completely fine, but I'm judging it on the scripting. And I believe that the scripting is beautiful. Clearly, the people that wrote this, scripted this, voiced this, are fans of the show, you know, tenfold. You know, they know their shit. I appreciate the references to the manga and other... Like, I, I like the subtleties. I appreciate it. As a fan of Bleach, I do appreciate it. Uh, I don't know why I waited 16 episodes to do this mini review at the beginning, but I just wanted to do it uh, because it's what came to mind. And, you know, that's that's the reaction I'm having right now, the legitimate. I just finished episode 15. I had my little rant at the end of episode 15. I opened up episode 16, and this is the reaction I'm having to just opening the video. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. So, <laughs> enjoyable absolutely enjoyable uh let's continue on with the episode ichigo you made it to class i like your bandages yeah i uh 
I like your bandages too. They really show off your curves. I heard we were getting a handful of new students today. Why? They're replacing students who dropped dead in the park yesterday. Why would anyone drop dead in the... Oh. <laughs> oh, that's sad. All the students at this academy are staring at us. Surely they're admiring how aesthetic we all are. Hey, listen up, all you freaks. It's tattoos, a bald student, an albino midget, rainbow eyebrows, and balloon-sized boobs. Y'all seen it before. Quit gawking. Here it is. We found it. Hello, Ichigo, fellow student who we are also Kurosaki. We are your new students who have never met you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? <laughs> we haven't forgotten being tricked, Longhorn. Have I said that before? I feel like I've said that before. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Why are you guys here? I, too, am also here as well. I bet you never thought you'd see me again, substitute Soul Reaper Ichigo Kurosaki. Really? Rukia, why are you in the window, Rukia? You are super blowing our cover right now. Hey, Ichigo. Ichigo. Remember when I was a powerless soul and you threw me off the execution stand? Yeah. Yeah! What the heck? <laughs> Not so powerless now, am I, you jerk? Now come with me! Um, what happened to him? He's dead. We killed him. Go tell everyone. You know, Renji would pass off as a Yakuza like that. With those tattoos, no doubt. Though the Yakuza in Japan aren't as flashy as that. You know, you watch TV shows, movies, play video games, and you see Yakuza with... You know, Aizen style, backwards spiked hair, flashy purple pink suits. They're not like that. Some of them are, okay, but not close. the straight one, guys. Land. Thank goodness. What am I? The Inuyasha Express? Ichigo, you see that hollow mining its own business down there? Yeah. Well, go kill it! What the heck is wrong with you today? Wow, she's on a Don't period. Ichigo, throw chocolate! The hollow in front of you is just a beast and will kill you if you hesitate. Hey, hollow. Me and you have a lot in common. Why don't we talk about it? Ow. Wait, but isn't he so powerful that the hollow should literally break its them. hand? Kill them, you idiot. But Rukia, at heart, they're like you and me. Did Ichigo, Ichigo go through his period? It said your mother deserved it. No. Yep. No. Heard it myself. I'll Low blow. Ah, <laughs> 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 that right there is how soul reapers do. That was a low blow, Rukia. Ichigo has a thing to say, real quick. I'm uh, sorry. I got you hurt the other day. Rukia seems to think I can be everywhere at once. He can he's just not trying hard enough. That's okay. It was pretty stupid of Chad and I to rush in like that. But anyways, wow. do you want to? Yeah, it was. Do you want to go to a movie sometime? Why? <sighs> Never mind. Oh wow! Welcome back, Espada's Four and. Another number. Why don't you treat us to what you saw? Lord Groban. Just call him ten. Upon arriving in the human world, we quickly encountered- Ah, uh, uh, uh. Save everyone's time. Use the eye. Yes, sir. Here. This is the abridged version of my memories, given directly to your senses. How strange. These abridged memories appear more absurd than the original. The characters hardly resemble the originals. There are also seems to be an uncomfortable amount of people in this abridged version all sounding like the same guy. I wouldn't know anything about that. Several parts of your abridged memories are missing. Give them back. I want them. Yes, some of them have been blocked. You'll notice it's only one in every five memories. It's a bit inconsistent. The twelfth memory is blocked only in Germany. I still haven't figured that one out. I'm Copyright! Hey, shit stain! Looks like you got your ass handed to you! That is factually incorrect. Shut your mouth, you albino dumbass! Alright, I will. If I'd been there, I'd have shown him what's what. Just gone up and like... Uh, right? Give him the old... Uh, just like it with their head and... Uh, right in my hand! One, two, ha! Just like that. Right? You get it. Right. You can't talk to Yuki or her like that! The abridged memories just didn't correctly translate the stakes of what was happening! I would argue that they emphasized them, but to each their own. Gee, it sure would be terrible if a small group of dedicated fighters tried to impress me by, say, disobeying my orders, attacking Ichigo and friends, and caused exploitable chaos. Grimjaw. Ding! 
awesome idea. I hope it's not those things I just said. May I regenerate my eye now? Finally, some quiet. Today's been crazy. Oh man, I hear ya. Relaxing would be nice. All clear! Time to meet you, girl. Oh, nice room. Love the Quincy sheets. Okay. Okay. That's not the you ratio of guys to girls to in a bedroom that's favorable, but okay. Get out of my house. Aw, dude. Come on. <laughs> no, look at God. No need for all look this at him. hostility, man. Seriously, what's keeping those things in? I think you were the kind of guy who'd own a perverted teddy bear. Honestly, sometimes I forget he's here. Let's keep this brief. We're here as a deterrent, in case more of Josh Groban and Zaron Car show up. What? What was that? What? He was just talking about Josh Groban. Zaron Car. Can you guys not say Eisen? Rukia, say Josh Groban. Josh Groban. Now say Eisen. Josh Groban. He's using Kyoka Soigetsu to make everyone hear his name as Josh Groban. I'm not affected, so I can say it? How does he have time for this? Because I don't know. I get bored sometimes too. It's a thing to do. Who, who are you responding to, Lord Groban? Hmm? Oh, nobody, Ulkiora. Nobody this, at all. This fucking guy. He is fucking insane. Beyond measure. Right, dumbasses, here's the plan. Kick some ass, take zero names, because fuck names, and bring back stories that'll make Ukiora keel over dead. How are we supposed to find them? Open your pesquisa. What? Like, in public? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 enemies and 6 of us. Man, they're gonna get wasted. We're gonna just, just punch them, right? Right in the face, just take your hand and bam, like, oh, just like that, wasted, right? This is Grim Jow's squad. Oh, Christ, he's screwed. Because I don't know, I get bored sometimes too. It's a thing to do. I love how insane fucking Aizen is. I, my favorite thing about when I started watching Bleach was everyone told me not to watch the end of the Iran car arc because it ruins it. And I was like, do I watch it or do I not watch it? Do I watch it? Do I not watch it? And I watched it and I was like, this fucking ruined it. When you read into it a little bit, it's just fucked. Oh my god. God damn it, Josh Groban. It is so anticlimactic. <sighs> you have a hidden talent you don't know about, like Pyrrhus Hilton being an actress. <laughs> Wait, kid, you dropped your Trying microphone. To put a on his ass. You want to be an Air Force Ranger? You want to live a life of danger? You don't want to get raped by strangers? 